Hi, in this interview you can know many things about Zimbabwe, Africa. And could you tell us uh, which are your biggest challenges with this project? Uh, what has been hard to work on it? Okay. Yeah, basically the major challenge that we have been facing since the day we arrived in Brazil is the issue of language. Most of the business people around and even ordinary people, they speak Portuguese, but from Zimbabwe we speak English and other local languages. So that is the major hindrance because we cannot communicate our interests as well as hear or get feedback from the Brazilians. But in terms of opportunities, they are abundant opportunities, but it is difficult to explore them when we are facing this issue of communication. Barrier. Sugar, as we were talking before, the Vice President of Zimbabwe is coming on Saturday. Uh, what will she be doing here? Uh, thank you very much. Uh, the Vice President will be in Brazil. She is here on the invitation of her counterpart, that is the lady uh, president. So she will be here. She is, like I said, she is leading that uh, business delegation, which is comprising business people from across all the sectoral divide. So she will be here to meet her counterpart, as well as discuss other areas of possible cooperation between Brazil and uh, Zimbabwe. So we are quite uh, hopeful that uh, engagements will pay dividends for mutual benefit. That is for the benefit of Zimbabweans as well as for the benefit of Brazilians. And how many people are here with you right now? You have another friend with you from Zimbabwe here? Yes, 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 precisely. Like I said, uh, we are coming from Zimbabwe as a business delegation. We have got officials from the various uh, ministry departments as well as from the private sector, that is independent business people. In terms of uh, the sectors they work, we have got uh, people who are coming, uh, who are representing the agricultural sector, the mining industry, tourism industry, trade and commerce. So all in all, there are quite a number of Zimbabweans who are part of this delegation being led by the Honorable Vice President of the Republic of Zimbabwe, Comrade Joyce Mjuri. And Sugar, tell us where uh, are you going next and what are your, what is your highest expectation with this project? Well, uh, our highest expectation is obviously to make sure that we closely cooperate with Brazilians, especially in regard to tourism. Basically, I'm speaking from a tourism point of view. So what we want is to make sure that we also, we also um, launch this brand that is Zimbabwe World of Wonders in Brazil so that we can have as many people as possible coming down to Zimbabwe, visiting Zimbabwe, because we've got a lot of uh, wonderful places in Zimbabwe that can be explored by Brazilians. But like I said, the major challenge is that of language, but we work, um, we'll see, we'll actually uh, devise a number of strategies so as yes, to make sure that we close that gap. But what we want is to make sure that we cooperate with Brazilians, especially for tourism development, especially also in the areas of tourism investment. Sugar, thank you so much for giving us this interview. I'm sure your project is going to be a really, really big success. And it's very important that you guys come all the way here to let us to know a little bit more you uh, and about you. And I, I'm sure that once Brazilians really get your culture, get every everything you guys want to do, uh, they're gonna want. So I wanna know myself, so uh, I'm sure it's gonna work out for you. And congratulations, and we're being here to, to help you. So this, is, this was our conversation with Sugar from Zimbabwe that is in here working on a very big tourism project. Thank you, and I see you around.